So today, we are gonna go explore Calgary with our friend David, who I met briefly for 30 seconds once. He's a good guy, he's good people. So we're gonna go, <laughs> he, he sent us an address. <laughs> we're just gonna go meet him up. And he has a van, right? Yeah, I think he's Or he has a van company. He has a van rental company. But we're gonna meet him uh, at this address in Calgary. It actually, I think there's a big overlook. You can see like all of Calgary, but oh. The day it's really hazy outside today. It's really smoky still. I know that's been like the theme of like our past couple of yeah. vlogs is hey, it's really smoky. It's still really smoky and there's still like five hundred active wildfires across Canada. So yeah. David actually texted me a little while ago and we're gonna sit down with him and look at our route because he was saying that we may need to change up our route as we head west towards BC just because of all the active wildfires that are happening. It's supposed to rain tomorrow. Yeah, hopefully they get a hopefully, that hopefully helps. they get a good bit of rain and that helps. But we're gonna pack up the RV and drive downtown to go meet David. Really hazy today. And we're we're gonna be biking. Yeah, we're gonna park and then bike into downtown and leave our van somewhere. Trying to film through one part of the windshield that isn't covered in bugs. Whenever we were driving across the prairies, there are a ton of butterflies, like an unreal percentage of butterflies in the air. And um, we killed probably about half of them with our windshield. Not it's, intentionally. Not intentionally, but they just don't fly away fast enough. And so, Sorry very that. dirty. How is it driving into a downtown city? Not bad. No tow car, so that's convenient. Easy? Yeah, I think this is one of the biggest cities I've ever driven an RV into. So. Definitely. I'll tell you when I park. Yeah, that will be the true test. Although we're only 24 feet, so I'm pretty sure I could park just about wherever. Good. Okay, we made it to where we're gonna meet David. And he just kind of like sent us an address for where to park. And look at this view. Well, it is very smoky, but the perfect place to overlook all of Calgary. But we're a few minutes early, so while we're waiting for David, we're gonna hang out inside because it does smell like a campfire out there. All right, I think I just saw David pull up. Oh, great. All of our friends live in vans. <laughs> all of them. We don't have a lot of diversity. <laughs> That's not true. What's up, man? What's up? What's up? This is classy. Hugs, how are you? When he Good was see, like, man. oh yeah, David's me. bringing his van. I wasn't sure what's a picture. Dude, you I know? love it. Do so you think? build them? Yeah. Can we check it out? Of course. Come on in. We always meet random people in the park and then ask to go in their van. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to my van. <laughs> wow, beautiful. Dude. I could do this van life. Yeah. Should we just drop off the leisure? Maybe we should trade for a little bit. <laughs> just do a switch. The home that. swap. <laughs> How long is it? 22 feet. 22. That's almost as long as we are. Yeah. Yeah. That's insane. And uh, It looks beautiful. Thanks. You want to give me a little quick tour of David's van? Yes. Here's the tour. Here's the cab where you drive it. Here's the kitchen where you make the coffee. And there's where you sleep. <laughs> where I want to take you is just down to where the kind of that crane is over there mm -hmm. um, for lunch. I'm gonna take you on the bike path which goes all the way to the north of downtown, bring you into downtown, all the way back through like the heart, the like the soul of the city, and then basically come back to Inglewood to hit up a couple of breweries. Yeah. It's always nice when someone else plans your adventure. Somewhere. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's kind of our perfect day. All right, so I guess we should kick this thing off. Let's kick this thing off. All right, Woo. so we'll follow you. Yeah, Do you want to so text us the name of the brewery just in case? Yeah, it's called okay. Cold Garden. Cold Garden. Yeah. May I? Yep. Thank you. Travel is always so much more fun when you have a local around who's like, yeah, I'll show you all the best spots because they know the best spots and because you get to see just how much people love where they live and how much pride they have for you know Calgary or Canada or New Zealand or wherever it is they are. David just ran into the brewery to kind of see where we can park the rig. That's the biggest hassle of being in an RV, not having a car, and being in a city. It's finding a place for this bad boy. I meant the RV, not Heath. That was an <laughs> unintentional pan. <laughs> 
What's okay. the word? So the word is we're good to park here. Mm -hmm. Um, it's really just past those cars, and there's a longer strip of the gravel park parking okay. lot down there. Cool. Found a place to park. Heath's gonna do a nice, you know, 20 point U turn real quick and then back up right here so that in case more cars come to the brewery, we are not blocked in. Smart. Made it! Look, they're best friends. One of the cool things about this rig is that it comes with built in bike storage. All right, there we go. So not to keep the bikes separate? Yeah, just keep them from not clinking together. Four years of travel, first time to ever drive downtown in a city, get out and ride our bikes around. We get falling down Until we start to tear But we can still be strong So wipe out all your teeth Bike from Inglewood into the East Village. You said East Village? Yep, East Village. We're locking up the bikes over here, gonna grab a bike to eat, and then continue biking around Calgary. This originated at their first location in the middle of downtown where they just opened, they had leftover burgers. They were just like, well, let's open up the window and sell Alley Burgers. They're the best burgers. Really? Have, yeah. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> and this is where you order from. <laughs> I love it. I feel like we're about to rob the place. Oh. It's only open. It's only open a little bit, but I'm getting the wafting of the burgers. And oh, it smells fantastic. real good. David, this looks amazing. Yeah, I hope you like it. This is uh, kind of a, a city classic, so mm -hmm. yeah, enjoy. What'd you get, babe? I got a burger. <laughs> I'm not stupid. Had one of the best burgers of my entire life. You say that about every burger. That's not true. This one actually was, I think, one of the best burgers ever. The game plan for the rest of the day is we are going to continue bike riding around downtown. He mentioned something about an ice cream shop and ending at a brewery. So probably a food coma happening at some point today. Been biking along the river made it here to the peace bridge which is the most photographed place here in calgary but even though it's beautiful and people love to hang out here now when it was originally built people hated it can you believe that <laughs> why'd they hate it they uh a lot of people didn't like it because it was a foreign designer who designed it and then um and then it also cost a lot of money to build and actually went over budget so not a good thing but yeah people love it now City of Calgary. You're gonna hit me. I'm not, I'm good. places that we visited they're like oh yeah it's super bikeable and they've always been wrong but Calgary is very bikeable especially for people like us that are slightly intimidated by biking around cars where have we gone so far <laughs> there's the most awesome super CRV Calgary about to go it. past me I stopped to talk to them a minute ago to ask them about it and they use that super C for like whenever there's, if there's floods or anything like that, it's a basically, it's a mobile command vehicle. It's a mobile office and I want it because it's awesome. You're not a cop. But it, I still Just like the toy. RV, yeah. <laughs> we should do more biking tours of cities, it's fun. Yeah, I agree. It's nice, it's nice to go on a tour around a city, not in a vehicle or in an RV where you're stressed about traffic and stuff. Just taking a bike around town has been a lot of fun. And we have our own little personal tour guide. Yes. So always make friends in places before you go there. Have a tour guide, see all the cool stuff. <laughs> we made it 
back to the parking lot. And our RVs are still there, so good time. <laughs> Anyone watching, Cold Garden down in Inglewood in Calgary, just ask them. They're cool with it. <laughs> nice big spot. We got the rig RV parking over there. Brewery right there. Yeah. Cheers. Yeah. More road trip adventures. Yeah. Thanks for the tour, man. And you can also rent out one of his sweet vans, Karma Campers. Yeah. <laughs>